It's not surprising, but love conquers all, and cockroaches can make music out of their legs. Uh, that fabulous guy teaching science who removed the leg of the cockroach. <laughs> that a cockroach can sing without a leg. That was crazy. So the cockroach's leg is still alive <laughs> and can think like my brain. That's the science teacher I wish I had had. Well, as an electrophysiology expert, I have to say I, I love the idea of being able to do a live demo of an electrophysiology experiment on stage. I learned that the color pink can be an act of rebellion. That we can actually mine uh, brine for um, chemicals. It's one of those stories that takes um, something that's going on in one sphere and connects it with something going on in another sphere, and it just is like a force multiplier. It's very, very cool. I love the idea that she has of connecting the emotional side to technology. No, it's just beautiful to see really the power that ideas can have. And this new innovation that she's done with three-dimensional shadow making. I thought that was fantastic. I mean, what's most exciting is seeing the audience just react to the brilliance on stage. I love the juxtaposition of the archaeologists using satellite photography to find ancient civilization and then ending with a piece by Bach played on the violin. But you see somebody who's really good at something that you've never done and it really challenges you. And so I really like what Robert did. It's like the, the range of human endeavor brought together in one afternoon.